Hey everybody, this is WFLA Chief Meteorologist and Climate Specialist Jeff Berardelli, and I want to tell you about a brand new report that just came out on these really big heat domes around the Earth. And July, by the way, is going to turn out likely to be the hottest July on record, so for the past over 100 years, and likely the hottest July on record in the last 120,000 years before the last ice age. Now, contributing to that is what you see right there. Heat domes sprawled all across the southern part of the mid-latitudes. That's places like Texas, and Mexico, and the deep southwest. That's also across the Atlantic, especially in southern Europe and into China as well. Now, a group called the World Weather Attribution uh, they are a bunch of scientists that came together and decided to do an analysis to kind of study exactly how human-caused climate change has affected these heat waves and made them more or less likely. And here's what they found. They found that the heat wave in the deep southwest, so Mexico, in the southwestern United States, and Canada, would have been virtually impossible without human-caused climate change. They also found it was about 4 degrees Fahrenheit warmer than it would have otherwise been in the whole region. That's a lot. Across uh, Southern Europe, they also found that basically that heat wave could not have happened without the fingerprint of human-caused climate change. So the burning of fossil fuels and the release of these heat-trapping greenhouse gas emissions. They also found that that was made about 4.5 degrees Fahrenheit warmer than it would have otherwise been in a non-heated climate. And then lastly, China, that was found to have some fingerprint of uh, climate change, uh, made 50 times worse by human-caused climate change, and in terms of temperatures, made about 2 degrees Fahrenheit warmer than it would have otherwise been. If you want to read more about this uh, particular study and just how warm uh, climate is making these heat waves, you can read below in our article.